Hello everybody, my name is uh, Mr. Sharma, and I'm going to teach you guys for Minecraft, of course. should say that in the title bar. How to download Mod Loader, Single Player Commands, and Too Many Items. Okay, so first of all, I'll put the link to download all of these in the description. Okay, so open Finder, and um... Yes, so you find library here, click application support, and you scroll down until you find Minecraft. When you find that, you'll have a few like texture packs, stats, screenshots, saves, resources, and yeah, go to bin, B I N, go to Minecraft jar. You see how it's still like a jar and it's like all these guys, and when you try and open it, unless you have a jar. What opener or whatever you call it. I don't know. It won't let you open it. So you have to see, yeah, could not be launched. So you have to right click, open with. This is the default, but you want to choose archive utility. That unarchives it, and you get a new folder called Minecraft. You take this and you just drag it into the trash. And now you go here, get info, go to the name, oh no, it's down here, dot, this is the extension you have to add. So if this is minimized, it'll say name and extension. You just click that arrow and see, you add dot jar. It'll say, are you sure you want to add the extension dot jar to the end of the name? So click add. So now, we can open it up and we've got uh, all of our classes or whatever, our environment. Now we're just gonna push you there. We're gonna put mod loader up here, single player commands, and too many items. Too many items and single player commands, they don't they don't re require mod loader, but I'm just gonna show you how to download mod loader for the sake of it. So open up mod loader. It says on the website that you need to um, like go to terminal and type in all these codes. <laughs> in reality, you can just open up the... Whoa. These two are exactly the same. Okay, close. In reality, you can just open it up. You see all these classes. You just go all the way down. Click. Drag. Not in, don't go into any folders. Just drag it off to the side here. And I'll say, you want to replace everything. The quicker thing is just to click apply all, but I never do that just in case. And. Okay, so now it's all there. Close that. Bye bye. So now you have Mod Loader installed. Uh, I'll have another video showing how to install mods. Yeah. Just comment section what mod you want me to install, and I'll pick one of you guys to ask. I'll pick one of you that comments, and I'll do that mod. So you do the same for everything. Open up too many items. Take everything and drag here. Replace anything that pops up. Boop. Open up single player commands. Um, so, this time we have something else. Copy everything except, now, you have everything copied, hold command, click world edit, and click read me text. Now just drag everything over, replace again. The read me text is just, it's just, just, yes, general information, usage, command list, command examples, property files, everything. So if you want to keep like a command list or stuff, you can drag this onto your desktop, or in my case, I just usually delete it. Now, the world edit.jar, you need to go back to this bin area, I think. I'm not good at this. And you just drag that in there. And so, like, instead, not in Minecraft jar, not in here, it will, and then back and just right here, inside the Minecraft folder itself. Okay? Thank you guys for watching. My next video will tell you how to install a mod with these new things. 
also show you how to, I'll show you a little bit how to use single player commands and too many items. And yeah, provide a link for all the if you need additional help, I can probably Whoa, I must quit you. If you need additional help, you can probably watch some more videos, but I feel this covers it all. Yeah. I'll provide all the links that are necessary for too many items, single player commands, and modeler. Thanks for watching, guys, and um, Mr. Sh Mr. Shwarma out.